Hey everyone, as you might as well know already, if you want to overcome anxiety, if you want to create something new in your life, if you want to make a change in your life, you need to change your behavior. Okay, so in order to change your behavior, I'm going to give you guys five key elements, five key things that you need to start doing today if you want to change your behavior, stop living your life in fear and worry and start living your life uh, by reaching your full potential and living abundantly on this beautiful day in Vancouver. And these steps need to be implemented right away and they need to be um, reminded, you need to remind yourself of these steps on a daily basis, okay? The first one is to create a sense of urgency. You know, a lot of people, when they're dealing with anxiety or they're living a life full of fear and worry, they're okay with how things are going. You know, they say, well, this is good enough. As long as it doesn't get worse, I'm okay right now. But that's not a good way to live. That's, you're basically living in fear and, and in your comfort zone and, and, and not really living a fulfilled life. So you need to create a sense of urgency to create the change um, that you want to see within yourself. Number two is create a vision. What do you want your life to look like? When you're done anxiety, when health anxiety doesn't uh, doesn't uh, overwhelm you on a daily basis when fear and worry is not an issue anymore what kind of vision do you have for your life as far as your career goes your relationships go as far as everything goes you know your relationship with your kids and so on create a vision of what you want your life to look like number three communicate that vision everywhere so the more you you communicate your vision to people um, the people that you talk to and the communicating it with yourself on a daily basis you're gonna find that you start to attract good things into your life you start to attract good people into your life good circumstances and things start to change you know, a lot, the, the big reason that things are not really going well for you right now, you're living a life filled with fear and worry, you're living a life in your comfort zone, it is be, because you're communicating this fear um, energy to the people that you're coming in contact with. You're continuously reminding yourself of how things are bad and how things might go in the future. So you need to turn that around and communicate this new vision. Be the vision. Communicate the vision to everybody that you see. Number four, plan and execute small wins in your life. So basically, if you want to, you have this overall goal, this vision in your life. Um, of what do you want what you want it to look like but the key to changing your behavior the key to getting over fear and worry is to build confidence and to build confidence you need to start experiencing these small wins in your life so a small win could basically be I mean if you have a fear of say elevators and and you go up a one floor let's say and you get off that's a, that's in itself a win if you have uh, agoraphobia for instance and you're scared to go outside um, and you're stuck indoors you know going outside and communicating with someone even if it's for five minutes that's a win if you're scared of you know if you have social anxiety and you go out and you mingle with some people let's say at the bar and you only stay for 10 minutes and, and you shoot out of there that's a win so so plan and execute some small wins in your life and keep challenging yourself through these small wins guys because that leads to number five which is it which is the key element to changing your behavior and that's growing confidence in this new vision that you have in this new character that you want to become so there it is create a sense of urgency create a vision communicate the vision everywhere you go plan and execute these small wins in your life grow your confidence daily and you will change your behavior as well www.anxietyexit.com check out the anxiety guy podcast i'll answer any of your questions through there see you guys soon take care